All right, I'm joining you from an entirely different food truck rally, one we'd never gone to before. This one is hosted by the Lone Peak girls volleyball team as a fundraiser for their team. And if you look around, um, pretty good participation from lots of different trucks. Uh, lots of different people are here. Um, so I see behind me, for example, Spuds has a new truck. Uh, but tonight we tried Susie Thai food. And this is the owner proprietor Mark here, spelled with a K. He does it right. And inside is his wife, um, actually from Thailand. She has been making Thai food for 50 years. Growing up in Thailand, she lived on a farm where they grew their own rice, their own peanuts, you know, they, they raised chickens, etc. So they, they had all of the ingredients right there. They raised this food on their own to consume it there. Uh, so the, the start of this food truck was about a year ago when Mark here wanted to order palm juice. That's juice that comes from a palm tree. And I, I really have no way of describing what palm juice tastes like. If you haven't tried it, it's worth trying. It's an experience on, on its own. Uh, but in order to order palm juice and import it from Thailand, he had to buy an entire crate of it. So not just a flat, not just a six pack or something, he had to buy a crate, like an air freight sized crate of palm juice. And he figured, well, the best way to sell this would be by pairing it with some Thai food. Hey, honey, you're really good at making Thai food. Why don't we start a food truck? And you know what? I think it was a great decision. Um, what you're mostly going to get here is rice-based, excuse me, rice-based curry dishes. Um, so you're not getting, you know, the noodles and pad thai and things like that. It's it's uh, rice bowls with sauce on them, all the vegetables and things. It was really delicious. Um, initially, they they gave us uh, one of them came with pecans, or excuse me, cashews. One of them came with cashews, and uh, I don't eat tree nuts, I can't eat tree nuts, so um, they swapped it out for us with a different one, but their, their masaman, their coconut curry, everything was really delicious. So for $10, a little bit high on the price point when it comes to food trucks in general, but you get a bowl with plenty of food. You know, I'm, I'm a grown man and I struggle to eat the entire thing by myself. Uh, my wife had one and shared it with our kids, so, you know, Plenty of food for what it's worth. Check out Suzy. It's the only Thai food truck I am aware of in Utah. Uh, it's the only one I've encountered. I've, I've seen Japanese, Chinese, you know, the sushi trucks, Hawaiian food trucks like Good Grinds over here, lots of uh, pizza places, taco places, etc. But this is the only Thai food truck I'm aware of. And you know what? I think it's worth it. Come check it out. Um, not the best Thai food I've ever had, but I'm partial to noodle-based Asian foods, particularly Pad Thai, so um, as far as coconut curries go, this was great. Served piping hot, um, delicious fresh ingredients, and she knows what she's doing, right? She's Thai, so she comes by it honestly. All right, check them out if you haven't, and uh, subscribe to this channel while you're at it, since you've been watching my videos anyway, I'd appreciate you subscribing. And then over here, check out some of the other videos that I've made. Let me know in the comments below what you'd like to see me review next. Thanks.